Out of the way, Dobie. Hi, welcome back to Auto Tip Off. Enjoy today's video. If you would like to fly non-stop from California to New York, you'll need a mid-size aircraft or bigger, as well as at least two pilots. Honda Aircraft Company, on the other hand, wishes to change that. Honda revealed its Honda Jet 2600 concept this week at the National Business Aviation Association's Business Aviation Convention and Exhibition in Las Vegas. Despite the fact that it is merely a prototype, Honda is claiming several game-changing characteristics. The manufacturer claims that this will be the first light aircraft capable of non-stop flights across the United States, as well as the first transcontinental jet intended for single-pilot operation. Light jets can only fly for three to four hours at a time and require one or two fuel tanks. The Honda Jet 2600 has a wingspan of 17.3 meters and a length of 17.6 meters, both measurements roughly 5 meters larger than the current type, which puts it in the light jet category. With a maximum capacity of 11 people, including the pilot, it would carry more passengers than the current 7 or 8. It'll have a maximum cruising speed of 450 knots and a 47,000 foot flying ceiling, which is unprecedented in the industry, or about 8.9 miles above the surface of the Earth. Not bad for an aeroplane that will be 20% more efficient and emit 20% less carbon dioxide than the average light jet. You'll discover one of three new modular layouts inside. This adaptability allows for up to 11 passengers, however you should restrict your load to 5 people to keep the plane running efficiently. The cockpit will be outfitted with cutting-edge flying technology and electronics, such as autothrottle and autobrake. These features contribute to the plane's ease of flight, making it the first transcontinental jet that can be flown by a single pilot. The all-new chairs have a more ergonomic design than the previous version, with 180-degree swivel capabilities and reclining footrests. A bed may be installed in the aircraft's rear utilizing footrests between seats and a lightweight mattress. Because the engines are located on the wings, the new aircraft features a full-height galley in front, as well as a huge cargo hold on the bottom of the fuselage. The Honda Jet 2600, as amazing as it may seem, is still only a concept at this point. There are currently no plans to bring the plane into production, similar to the more futuristic concepts showed off by its parent firm. Having said that, don't be shocked if some of its more fascinating concepts, particularly the new engine layout, make their way into the company's future aircraft. Honda Aircraft, a newcomer to the industry, competes with such established players as Bombardier, Cessna and Embraer. Deliveries of the Honda Jets began way back in 2015. Three types have been released so far, and the total number of aircraft delivered exceeds 170 worldwide. Last year, 31 aircraft were delivered. Maybe somewhere in the near future the 2600 will join the company's lineup. After all, the time could not be more perfect. Private jet demand is currently at historical levels, with sales increasing by 30%. It's not a bad time to enter the market for fuel-efficient light planes with extended range. There you go internet friends, my take on the Honda Jet 2600, my first aircraft review, kind of. Don't forget to be around tomorrow for my next video, till then ta for now.